Hello everyone, Looney Farm Guy here with, uh, well, the last new mod for today that I'm going to review. For January the 21st, it is Friday, and what do we have here? Well, <clears throat> obviously it's a low loader, but this is the 20-foot gooseneck trailer by 82 Studio. Yes. So, as you can see, well, it it, uh, it is what it says it is um as you can see it straps down uh, tractors uh, go up on it pretty nicely uh the uh, <clears throat> brand name lizard logistics at a2 studios it's not allowed to use their own brand anymore however um that is uh, how it is branded and then we also has a, a version uh a <clears throat> a trailer hitch version rather than the gooseneck version which we will show how those all hook up um i did notice a bit of an issue with this um, when it got strapped down so as you can see it's um, got some collision issues i guess or non-collision issues a little bit strange there although I haven't tried moving it off. I don't know what it... Oh, it's... it's. Oh. Yeah. I... Oh, it's strapped down still. Mm. Uh, we can fix that. Anyways, let's look at it first in the store, shall we? Uh, it'll be under tools, low loaders, all the way over here. Oh, there we go. Lizard Logistics, the 20-foot gooseneck trailer. And only $8,000. That is now the cheapest low loader, I do believe. And here we go. Uh, it has a, some options. Uh, the wood looks really nice. I like that look of the wood. Uh, or you have the metal, the, uh, the diamond plate type plating. Uh, I do prefer the wood. Uh, the branding is like just the name on the... the the gooseneck or the tongue of the trailer. Uh, attached type goo uh, it is bumper pull or just standard um, hookup or the gooseneck which kind of looks pretty nice too. Anyways, <clears throat> uh, wheels. Uh, we have a couple of wheels. Uh, Nokian wides, kind of like an agricultural and back to the just standard highway type tires now colors is your uh your typical a2 studio uh palette i guess you could say a very wide range of colors and uh that is not surprising at all a little bit less for the rims but still a good a very good um <clears throat> variety so how do we hook these up well we got three vehicles here obviously a tractor is going to be the, your best um choice i would say for this one uh let's un okay there we go so if you unstrap it it's uh yeah okay so when it gets strapped down it has a little bit of that little <clears throat> uh, strap yeah okay that's that's what's happening there <clears throat> when you strap it down it she kind of sinks in a little bit that's no big deal uh options for the trailer unfold the trailer yes we're gonna go zip around here because that's gonna put down our ramp and there it is it says it's a nice wide ramp and it definitely is a nice wide ramp uh fasten the uh and unfasten R3 right stick oh, come on right stick and R3 and um, that's oh yes um, so with the uh, bumper uh, hitch on it you can raise and lower these these little yeah there, those little guys those feet at the front <clears throat> by our uh, your right stick right and left with the L1 button pressed 
the raise front loader arm, uh, the R up and down, it does nothing uh, with this setup. Yeah, just the just that, uh, the right and left, but not up and down. <clears throat> and I'll show you why. Um, <clears throat> you say, why do you have a pickup truck? Well, I'll show you why I have a pickup truck. If you back it up, nice and slow, see? It can attach a gooseneck trailer. If you didn't know that, now you do. Uh, so, <clears throat> now if we look at that uh, L1 and raise front loader arm, that is what it's for. We will raise and lower the attachment. That looks kind of obscene in some way, or somewhat. Uh, <laughs> uh, anyways, um, semi, yep. So we truck will hook up to that gooseneck as well. And it'll look like that. And of course, it has that adjustment with the gooseneck as well as the uh, whoop, right and left. Sorry, let's zoom in there. Right and left. Or uh, the right stick back and forth to the right and left. And the uh, unfold, of course. And there it is. Uh, the only thing I did notice was uh, <clears throat> a lot of the, tra the trailers have extendable sides. Uh, this does not. So that, which is, which is fine. That wood looks really real, actually. Um, so it's, it's, it was a, just a tad tricky getting, uh, getting this. I made it fit, no problem. Uh, you just have to be careful guiding it on there and uh, perhaps there are a few things that may not fit um, I didn't try uh, this is just I uh, tried a couple of things I didn't try everything um, <clears throat> and um, yeah other than that oh uh, one thing to note um, with the pickup trucks and this uh, it is a little bit, uh, a little bit too much. Well, it pulls it fine, but turning, you can see it's like, <laughs> um, so it's a little bit, uh, it's a little bit big for it, shall we say, and uh, it, you'll have a little trouble, yeah. So, it's, it's doable. Um, just not ideal. And, um, yeah, that's about it. I, uh, it's a gooseneck trailer. It's a, it's a low loader. And everything seems to strap down fine. As you can see, that, that tractor did not move a mudge, a smudge, even a little bit. <clears throat> the detail is, is fantastic. Um, yeah, that would, I mean, I, that really looks real, um, I just have to say. He does some very, very fine work, indeed. And that is your Lizard Gooseneck Trailer by A2 Studio. 7.68 megabytes to download. A, a fine addition to your trailer um, a collection, if you have one. Um, I'm Lily Farm Guy, and I approve of this mod. <laughs> and, and just remember, it's only a game, so have fun. Till next time. Uh -oh.